welcome back. Today, we are going to be customizing, painting, whatever you want to call it. Customizing sounds really cringy to me, so I'm just going to say painting my Alexa. <laughs> welcome, Alexa. Hello. Ah, well, thank you. Um, so, she is looking a little pretty dirty. Looking pretty dirty. Did I say dirty pretty? <laughs> <laughs> she is looking a little pretty dirty. Well, do we live in here? Anyways, um, yeah, so she is looking a little, uh, rough on the edges. Thank God I did not say pretty, pretty dirty. I haven't I gotten over that yet? Been taking great care of you, Alexa. Great take care of you. Anyways, um, today I'm going to be painting her, and the only thing I'm going to be painting is like this top part. I've been really scared to do this, and I didn't really know if I should or should not because I don't know if it was gonna wreck it. But I saw paint pouring on this, so that's when I uh, decided that it would be okay. That's the only need to get used to. Posca pens are going to be introduced, no, are going to be brought over a lot because they're just amazing creatures on, oh, <laughs> forgot the green. Well, you might as well just leave me there. Thing we all gotta do is, um, tape and I, we don't need to look at that. We're just gonna tape the edges. Whoa, <laughs> where are you going? As you can see, this was not working whatsoever at all. Um, so I took the time to trace out the little buttons to put them on. Yeah, this is definitely not gonna work. Okay, well, <laughs> that was just all that hard work of tracing those little buttons. <laughs> That's not gonna work. Decided to go with a uh, cool aesthetic feeling, um, and do like the background maybe like a yellow or pink, and just do some sunflowers, maybe a shooting star, a moon, like you know that whole aesthetic vibe. See, this is where it all kicks in my weirdness. <laughs> all right, so let's start. Um, I want to just do white because, as you can see, it's pretty, uh, brutal with all that, um, uh, all that stuff. So I think I might want to just go over it with some acrylic paint real quick because this Posca pen is not going to do the total entire job. So yeah, I think it'll be best to take some white acrylic paint. Go. So, um, as I'm painting this, I'm realizing that, you know, acrylic has a texture to it. I don't want a texture. And the, it is already really smooth itself, and I just feel like, no. So, we're gonna scratch that idea. I'm gonna go get a paper towel, and I think I'm gonna try to clean all these stains off, so... So here I go with trying to get an ecstatic feeling. Um, those like waves that a lot of people draw and they're popular. I wanted to try to do that. That was a total fair, not even close. I wanted to do it because ocean, you know, ocean's art, hello. So then I started to try to do planet, boom, that didn't, went crashed and burned. So I tried to think of something else to do and I started to do a sunflower, which came out <laughs> perfect. Um, and after that one sunflower, I started doing them all around the border, and that is when history was made. I mean, it was made in that quick of a second. But then, war began in my head when I realized what I had done earlier that few seconds ago, if that makes sense. No, that does not make sense. But what I had done a few seconds ago was going to ruin it all and make the whole, whole project that much worse. 
So this is how it is so far. Um, I decided to scratch the idea of just like that aesthetic feeling with all those different like combinations of it. I just decided to do some flowers along the edges, which I really, really like. And I think it's really cute. Cool. Not cute. <laughs> um, but this is a problem. So I think I want to do some flower in the middle and see if I can cover that up because it's really going to bother me. Because why not? Why wouldn't a blue dot? And it's just terrible. So hopefully I can do that. I really hope I can. And then we can um, continue with like shading with the sunflowers or anything we need to fix with them. So yeah. Satisfying. So this is not as planned. I tried to do it so many times, so many coats of the yellow, but the blue was just shining right through. And then I decided to go over it with white. So I had a base and I just restart it. No, <laughs> no, that did not work. And it, I just went over it completely again and again and again, but it didn't work. I was so doubtful, I had no hope whatsoever, so I started scraping the paint off. That just made it 10 times worse. I was hoping that I'd be able to scrape it all off, be smooth and happy again, but no, didn't work. Never worked, by the way. Um, so I just, I just, I really couldn't do anything at that point, and I was dead, dead. I didn't know what to do. So, um, yeah. That was a very big, long journey. I went over this another time with some white acrylic paint. And I'm thinking it looks much better than it was before. Anyway, um, this, I think, just has had some glow-ups, you know? Just has been brought to life in beautiful ways. Um... I think the only thing that's really left to do is Mod Podge the place where I put acrylic paint like right here because um I want it to have a smooth finish and you know <laughs> that is not smooth. I do happen to have Mod Podge right here. It helps with all your daily needs. I'm basically just going to take the Mod Podge and cover it over the acrylic paint um, because it's just going to make it a smoother finish and less look like acrylic paint and terrible, so yeah. So this is how it came out in the end. I really like the design um, of the flowers on the border, but the only thing I didn't really like was the flower in the middle, so... I definitely wanted to change that. The space theme did obviously not go well, and the aesthetic feeling just completely crashed and burned. So this is how it came out. I'm really, really happy with it, and uh, I think that it's really cute. I definitely want to clean that up a bit because that's been like this forever, and that's going to get really annoying. So, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Again, I really hope you enjoyed this video. It was a little slow. I kind of was struggling most of the time, but in the end, it became something great. So, Alexa, say goodbye. Goodbye. We'll see you another time. Have a great night, and um, I'll see you tomorrow because of my whack schedule this, whack schedule this week. Um, yeah. Because we got back from Florida, I have to stop making up excuses. I'm really sorry. Next week, we're going to start off on a great foot. This week has gotten better by the days with filming. So, yeah. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>